Welcome to a tutorial on how to use the waiting list feature. When you log into your account, you can click settings on the right and under your preferences on the left, you can click on waiting list. Here for preference number one, if you set that to yes, you can also allow your customers to be able to put themselves on the waiting list. When you click appointments on the top left, you'll see you can scroll down here on the lower left and you can view your waiting list. When you click here, this will show you the customers that are on the wait list. It'll give you the date and time of when they were added to the waiting list, their name, email, service, as well as the option to delete a customer if you need to. You also have a button to add a customer to the waiting list. Just note that you'll need to first add the customer through your customers tab. Then once they are added, you'll be able to add them to the wait list by selecting them from the drop down here. You can then select a staff member or leave it as no preference and then you can select the service and you can add notes here. Now we can add the customer to the wait list. Once you close and refresh, you'll see here on the top right, you can hover over your waiting list. This will now show you your customers on the wait list. You can now select a customer, select the start time for their appointment. This will now autofill that customer's information. We can click on next. Next, you'll see that you can send appointment confirmation emails to the customer and the staff member and now we can finalize that appointment. Once that appointment is finalized, you'll now see the customer scheduled as well as it will remove that individual from your wait list. Now let's take a look at the customer view. The customer can click on get started. They can select a staff member, no preference. They can select the service. If there's no time slots available, they can now join the wait list. Here, they'll be able to enter in their information based on the form that you've set up. So for example, and they can click join wait list. This will now add them to the wait list as well as send them a confirmation email to the email address provided. When you go back to site administration and just refresh the page, you'll now see that you have three customers on the wait list. So that customer has now been added. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to reach out to our support team and we can assist you. Thank you.